All right, here we go. We have the uh, Terrence Walker from in Oklahoma. Uh, he was killed. Uh, just another innocent, innocent black man killed by a white police officer. And uh, oh boy! So now we got a body cam that actually, the body cam is actually showing. Let me take my glasses off. I'm tired of wearing. The body cam is actually showing uh, him uh, evading arrest, and then he turns and then he drops something, which um, looks to be a gun. Of course, the naysayers are, are trying to say uh, he dropped his cell phone only, even though he's running from the police. He pulls, he turns around to do. So he once he turns around, uh, the 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 cop. And he picks something up, which is already known that he does have a gun. The witnesses also actually said that uh, he was trying to give the gun to someone as the cops were rolling up. He was trying to hey, hey uh, trying to get rid of the evidence. Hey, will you please take this gun because uh, yeah, he's coming for me. So we already have some deception there. We have uh, we have evading police and uh, and all that and. Uh, but the cool thing is, is we, we actually have a camera, a body camera now. And uh, it's pretty much undeniable proof that uh, when you get somebody out there that's doing the wrong thing, he's already threatened his uh, girlfriend. He dated her and told her he, he, that she's got a bullet with her name on it. He was up there at a uh, at a uh, church. Uh, I guess he was kind of crashing a wedding or, or whoever. And was, you know, uh, wanting to come up there and talk to her. Came up there with a loader, loaded gun. Hammers copped on it, by the way. Let it roll. Um, and uh, he was about to get cuffed and uh, taken away. And obviously knew he had that gun. So he takes off and starts running. He's off to the races. Boom. Off to the races. Black man running. They the police. What's all is this? He, he, I already see two. Two things right here. Two two things is that he was somewhere he wasn't supposed to be trespassing. Somewhere he wasn't supposed to be. He had a gun. Well, well, that, that, that's, that's three things actually. Uh, so he was wasn't where he was supposed to be. Somewhere he wasn't supposed to be trespassing. They called the cops on him because he was causing a ruckus. Whatever. She was in fear for her life. Uh, um, has a gun on him. And then he takes off to the races. <sighs> then he turns around, and, uh, picks up. I, I guess the I guess from the naysayers that I see in the comment section on on some of the news story, I guess he was supposed to. The cop was supposed to just you know tag him in a pinky toe or or, or or hit him. You know this dude's at full bore. Run turns around and 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 and. Uh, and starts to look looks like he's picking something up off the ground you don't know if it's the gun you don't know what cop shoots him just happens to be some killing blows I see three things or four things all the way already that's uh, not this cop's fault so why why are we why are we even in the face I, I, you know in the face of video proof Trying to say that this cop was wrong. Yeah. You know, that, you know, in uh, after the Ferguson and Trayvon Martin and all these other things, uh, a lot of people saying we think they should have body cameras. What's the point in body cameras if even if you see a black person doing something wrong and ends up getting shot doing it, you still say that it was his it was it wasn't it was the cop's fault so that's the true i guess that's almost like the true definition of an agenda is even in the face of proof you still are going to ride with what you were saying that's pretty bad i mean you you can see it's almost like a, an, a, an abused woman or a woman has been cheated on. She loves a guy so much. They, they, they go, her friends go and take her to the club and show her man, show her that her man is tongue kissing some woman. She still is like, well, you know, I, it's, 
I'm just blown away. There's there's comments all over saying that the cop was totally wrong. He was doing nothing wrong. The, the 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 young man Terrence was doing nothing wrong. Then I look at the news outlets and they're showing him with his mom on a picture. They're showing him and his mom just hugged up and and uh, and then they're showing his football pictures and stuff. Why don't you show Why don't you show the pictures of of him acting a fool? At, you know, up there. Uh, why don't you show the body cam things where him acting a fool over there, running away from the police? I mean, I'm pretty sure that you got some people saying this is. This is someone's son, or this could be someone's someone's dad. Charles Manson is someone's son. <laughs> okay, you know uh, that Jacinda Ramirez, the railroad killer, that was killing people. He was a serial killer. He was killing people on the railroad or whatever he was doing. He's someone's son. Might even if I wrong mistake. I don't know. He might be someone's dad. That doesn't mean anything to me. He could have been a Boy Scout. It doesn't mean anything to me. The thing is, is what he was doing right then and there. That shows what he really was. And he's a two-bit thug that got what he was, unfortunately, not looking for. But I guess you could say he was looking for because running from the police isn't going to get you anywhere. You, you Now you got them. He's running from the police. Now you got the police having to make split-second decisions and stuff. I never understood. I, 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 you know, I call you, I call you, of course, I call you savages. But, I, you know, I'm going to have to call you a savage if you're doing stuff like this. But whatever. And I, I'm going to say that they put you down like an animal because you are an animal because you're you run in front of the police and you're, you're being a general threat to society. But here's the thing is that how can you still act a fool in a face, in the face of someone that has your life on their very hip? It's right there. At least an animal can act, will act a fool or whatever and, and savage, be a savage. And because he doesn't really know what, this is. You even know what that is and you still act like a savage. The, the truth, as they say, is stranger than fiction. The, the truth is stranger than fiction. You can't make this stuff up. You can't. You can't make this stuff up that someone shows up to a wedding with a gun, starts running, turns around. You can't make this stuff up and that people would steal. You got black folks that will steal and some whites defend this fool and say that he was nothing but a, you know, he was nothing but a, uh, but a good kid and. Oh, we know him personally. Now, all of a sudden, everybody knows him personally on social media. Everybody knows him personally. So, like, oh, he's he's known personally. We, we know him. He's an upstanding minister. Yeah. Now, let him have shot that woman. Now, if he would have shot her, and after they had called the police, you know what would have been then? Is that, that the cops don't want to come in this bad black neighborhood. They don't give a damn about the black folks. That would have been the next one. You know, uh, we don't... They don't give a damn about about us. So, I don't know. Anyway, that's my video. It's a shame. Another black life gone. But who you gonna blame? Certainly can't blame Whitey. Not for this one. Now, can you? I know some of you want to. But can you really? <laughs> if you do... You're more of a savage than I think you really are.